A woman just won a national beauty contest representing women with curves. It's called the Miss Plus America pageant for women size 14 and above. Paula Toti has a story of how this young woman has more than one positive message to share. We are the face of the nation, not the people that they put on the front of magazines. The Miss Plus America pageant represents the majority. Over 60% of American women are their size. Like well, most other pageants, there was a talent portion. Why should I feel discouraged? And why did the shadows come? The judges like Yolanda Gould singing, but really like her. They said I was a very honest person, that they could see my heart on my sleeve when I walked in. She's honest about being 33. I asked your age. I won't ask your weight. I'll ask your height. 5'9". Yolanda knows our culture is obsessed with thin. She was a large child, but still competed in pageants, then stopped until she was diagnosed with uterine cancer and had a hysterectomy. I think anybody who has their womanhood taken away from them, that they don't feel like a woman. They don't feel beautiful about themselves. That was almost five years ago, now as a survivor. I do feel beautiful. Um, it took me a long time to get to the point where I felt like I was beautiful. In part because she mentors young girls, helps other women with cancer feel pretty at a time when they are at a low point. In her paid work, she helps people with disabilities find jobs, and she's just positive. I think that whatever size you are, you can make a positive difference in the world. When it comes to size, there's a reason I asked her height. Confession time. I most little girls want to wear a crown and a sash. Yes. I never could join Miss America. I'm skinny, Minnie, but I'm too short. Did you know there's a petite Miss America? You need to look into that, Paula. Sweet, but Yolanda, you're the one fit for a crown. Miss Petite America. Alexa, my producer, that's you. Okay, so the newly crowned queen says women should take control of their health. She says she was very persistent in getting a diagnosis and that cancer was detected early enough to save her life. Congratulations.